close, so close at the finish. Yeah, I was uh, a, a bit nervous. I don't think that quite cuts it. Um, it was one of them, you know, Jason's, Jason, isn't he? He's fast. He was in my back bumper on the, the last corner there on the last lap, and I wouldn't expect anything else. Um, but no, I'm just delighted to get a podium again. It's, it's been a while. Um, getting to grips with this year wheel drive thing, and it was a track I was dreading, actually. I expected to struggle this weekend, so I think two top tens, and, and to get a podium and finally reward the team for all the hard work they've put in, and putting up with me, winding myself up and getting frustrated to not, not getting back to the sharp end after watching Ash do it for fun. <laughs> it's, uh, it's just great to reward the team again and, and a nice feeling to be standing here again. How frustrating is that? That, you know, as you say, you, you can see your teammate performing in the car and you're thinking, I know I can do that and I've got wins in me. I think it was more frustrating knowing I couldn't do it at first. <laughs> but um, yeah, it's just uh, so many different uh, things in the, in the driving technique. And um, I've not done rear wheel drive prior to the Infinity, so you know to come and learn a trade in the British Touring Car Championship when it's so close that you know you can do a good lap, but that one little mistake has drops you down, and, and that's why we all love British Touring Cars. So yeah, it was, uh, it was frustrating, but I mean a massive thank you to my engineer Dan uh, Ash as well. You know he's been doing a lot of work with me on, on the simulator and um, helping me a lot away from the track, and it's putting a lot of the things. But they've, they've kind of helped me learn into this weekend that's, that's got us this result. So I can't really thank them enough, to be honest.